Hey there, today I'll be showing you a step-by-step -step tutorial on how you can track email opens and link clicks right in your Gmail and also how you can use our email finder tool. So the very first thing you want to do is you want to go to the Chrome Web Store and you want to type in Sales Handy Connect and add this extension to your Google Chrome Web Browser. Click on Add to Chrome, Add Extension. And it automatically says that your Sales Handy Connect has been added to Chrome. So the next thing you want to do is you want to pin the extension for easy access. So now you can easily access the tool as and when you want to. So you can directly sign up from the extension itself. So all you have to do is just launch the extension and click on create an account and you will be redirected to the sign up page. So after you have created your Sales Handy account, you want to go to your inbox and you want to click on the extension over here to launch it. And you will have to log in with your Sales Handy account. As you can see, once you've logged in, it shows that the email tracking is on for this particular account that I'm logged into. What we'll do is we'll compose an email and see how our emails get tracked. and click on send. So now let's go to our Sales Handy dashboard. Once again, you'll have to log in over here. So now that you've logged on to your Sales Handy dashboard, you want to go ahead and click on one-on-one -on -one email insights. All your email tracking activity is logged on to Sales Handy's dashboard. It is easy to keep track of all your individual emails, opens, clicks, and replies. As you can see, the email that we just sent is already being tracked over here. So now what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and go to the receiver's inbox and click on the email and we're also going to click on the link to see how it all works. So this is the inbox of the receiver. Let me click on the email. And also let me click on the link. And as you can see over here, you automatically get a desktop notification when the email is opened. Now we're back to the Sales Handy dashboard and just click on refresh. And you can see that it says that the email has been opened and it has been clicked. And if you want a more detailed report, you can just click on this and you can see the exact time the email was opened and the exact time the link was clicked on. So from here, you can filter out your different email accounts that are connected to Sales Handy Connect. And from here, you can search for emails and recipients if you like. So you can see just how quickly your emails are tracked. So every activity that is logged on to the Sales Handy dashboard, you can export in the form of a sheet and keep track of all your replies and clicks. All you have to do is click on this export button and your data will be downloaded in a CSV file format. So as we went over how to track emails with Sales Handy, now let's look at how we can find email addresses in a snap. With Sales Handy Connect's email finder, you can save hours of prospecting and find email addresses in a snap. So the first thing you want to do to use the email finder is you will have to log in to your LinkedIn account. When you're on their LinkedIn profile, click on the extension to launch it. And as you can see, their information automatically comes into the email finder. So if you click on show more fields, you can key in more information if you already have it. So here's a cool thing that you can do. If you want to add the email address that you've just extracted to a particular ongoing sequence in your Sales Handy account, you can do so directly from here. So all you have to do is click on add sequence, select the sequence, and select the step. And once you click on save prospect, it will automatically be saved in that particular sequence and that particular step. Adding the particular email address that you just extracted to a sequence is an optional step. So if you don't select this option, it will automatically get saved to your prospects list on your Sales Handy account. Once you've added the prospect in your sequence, let's go and see how it looks like on our Sales Handy dashboard. So once you're back here, just click on Prospects and click on Refresh. And you can see that this prospect has been added to this particular sequence that you had selected. 
This is how you can use our email tracking and email finder tool. I hope this video helped. See you next time.